Hello, good morning students. Welcome to my channel. Today in this class we are going to read the use of pronoun he, him, she or her. He, him or she or her ka use kaha or kaise hota hai. Now students first of all you should know that he and him are used for masculine gender for male persons and she and her are used for feminine gender for females we use she and her now when do we use he and she he and she are used to when the person is doing the action he or she pronoun ka use tab hota hai jab koi vyakti khud action kar raha hai khud kaam kar raha hai he is playing he is dancing she is reading she is writing so students he or she jab karne wala khud kaam kar raha hai tab hum he or she ka use karte hain now him and her are used when something is happening to the person jab किसी व्यक्ति के साथ कुछ हो रहा है तब हम हर और हिम का यूज करते हैं नाउ स्टूडेंट्स यहां पर आपको ध्यान क्या देना है यू शुड कीप इन माइंड ऑलवेज दैट ही एंड शी आर यूज बिफोर द वर्ब इन द सेंटेंस ही और शी का यूज हमेशा सेंटेंस में वर्ब के पहले होता है और हिम और हर का यूज हमेशा सेंटेंस में वर्ब के बाद होता है वर्ब मीन्स एक्शन वर्ड्स सो दे आर यूज आफ्टर द एक्शन वर्ड्स इन द सेंटेंस एंड ही एंड शी आर यूज बिफोर द एक्शन वर्ड्स इन द सेंटेंस फॉर एग्जाम्पल ही ही इज रीडिंग अ बुक वो बुक पढ़ रहा है नाउ हेयर वॉट इज एक्शन वर्ड रीडिंग सो ही इज यूज बिफोर एक्शन वर्ड बिफोर द वर्ब नाउ हिम दिस बुक बिलोंग्स टू हिम ये किताब उसकी है नाउ स्टूडेंट हेयर हिम इज यूज आफ्टर द एक्शन वर्ड एक्शन वर्ड बिलोंग्स सो स्टूडेंट इन दिस वे हिम इज यूज आफ्टर द एक्शन वर्ड एंड ही इज यूज बिफोर द एक्शन वर्ड एंड दीज बोथ pronouns are used for male gender or masculine gender now she is my friend wo meri dost hai i like her very much main use bahut pasand karta hu now students here she and her they are used for feminine gender now students let's do exercise now students let's do this exercise to clear this topic now here fill in the blanks are given you have to fill suitable pronoun in the blanks now first is dash he him works in an office so here before verb blank is there what will come he he works in an office now his uncle gave him or he a watch on his birthday so here action word verb is gave and blank is after action word so what will come his uncle gave him a watch on his birthday now next dash is a teacher in the school she she is a teacher in the school next everybody likes dash in the school everybody likes now here action word or verb is likes so what will come here her or she everybody likes her in the school so here fill her next i will give dash the money tomorrow i will give him the money tomorrow him now next dash is a very good cook now she or her what will come here she she is a very good cook now next here we have two blanks in this sentence let's see how to fill first dash he or him went with dash to the market so here he he went with she or her what will come went with her to the market so students in this way you will fill these blanks with pronouns students next exercise 11th is 
Take the correct sentence from the following pairs of sentences. Two sentences are given. Out of them, one is correct. You have to put a tick in front of the correct sentence. First is, all the teachers like him. All the teachers like he. So, which one is correct? First one is correct. All the teachers like him. This is correct, students. All the teachers like him. So, you will put a tick in front of this sentence. Now, next is... She is my best friend. Her is my best friend. So now which is correct? She is my best friend. So B part you will tick on. She is my best friend. Put a tick in front of this sentence. Now next one C part. Sandy's mother took her to the dentist. Sandy's mother took she to the dentist. So which one is correct? Again first one is correct. Sandy's mother took her to the dentist. Sandy's. Sandy then apostrophe S. Sandy's mother took her to the dentist. Students, this is correct sentence and you will put a tick in front of this sentence. Now next one, D part. We visited him at the hospital. We visited he at the hospital, which is correct. First one is correct. We visited him at the hospital. We visited him at the hospital. This is correct. So you will put a tick in front of this sentence. So students in this way in front of correct sentence you will put a tick and which is wrong you will put a cross in front of that sentence. So that's all for today. I hope you have understood use of he him, she and her. Students, if you like my way of teaching, press on like button, share your views in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe my channel. So that's all for today. We will meet again with another video. Till then, bye-bye. Have a good day children.